solve x square into d cube y by dx cube plus 3x d square y by dx square plus dy by dx is equal to x square into log x. Now you find the complete solution means y is equal to yc plus yp means particular integral plus uh, sorry y is equal to complementary function plus particular integral okay then we add it the complementary and particular you get complete solution before we are using the coach's linear equation steps then after I go to the complementary the next particular integral okay now we have given equation is x square y triple dash plus 3x y double dash plus y dash is equal to x square into log x this is not a standard coach's linear equation this is not a standard linear coach's linear equation you should be required x cube y triple dash x y double dash is there x square is required y dash is there x is required means multiply by whole equation x multiply, multiply by x whole equation means x cube y triple dash then plus 3 x square y double dash plus x y dash is equal to x cube sorry x cube log x now this is a coaches coaches linear equation this is standard form of coaches linear equation we call this is equation number one now this is a coaches means put t is a t is equal to log x or e raised to t is equal to x only now assume the results in coaches linear equation we assume x into y dash is a dy x square y double dash d into d minus 1 into y up to x cube y triple dash okay x cube y triple dash equal to d into d minus 1 into d minus 2 into y now d stand d by dt now these results using in equation number one okay now hence equation number one becomes means substitute these result in equation number one x cube y triple dash is d into d minus 1 into d minus 2 y is a common okay next is 3x 3 x square y double dash plus 3 into x square y double dash is 3 into d into d minus 1 plus x y dash is a d then y is a outside is equal to x square x square means what x is equal to what e raised to t x square means e raised to 2t into log x log x means what t into t okay now simplify open this bracket you get only d cube y is equal to e raised to 3 into oh sorry e raised to 2 into t sorry this is a x cube sorry x cube this is x cube sorry 3t 3t okay x cube log x is there now d cube open the bracket simplify this one the terms are cancel only remaining d cube into y equal to e to 3t into t now go to the complementary function first is a complementary function then after particular integral now find a complementary function means first find roots now auxiliary equation is auxiliary equation is m cube is equal to 0 whatever right hand side is a 0 now roots are m cube is equal to 0 is equal to 0 roots are 0 0 0 all roots are 3 roots 0 means complementary function is yc is equal to the roots are equal so 3 roots are equal 3 roots are equal means you write like this c1 plus c2 t plus c3 t square okay into e raised to m1 m2 m3 means e raised to m means 0 to t that means 
C1 plus C2 T plus C3 T square. Now this is a complementary function. Now go to the particular integral. Yp is equal to phi of x upon f of d. This is a phi of x. Phi of x is a e raised to 3t into t. Divide f of d means dq. Now this is a type 4 particular integral. d is equal to d plus a means e raised to ax into phi a means 3 now d is equal to d plus a e raised to t into t upon now d plus a means 3 a is a 3 whole cube this is a type 4 particular integral ok now this part is over e raised to 3t already applied into t upon a plus b whole cube formula a q plus b q plus 3 a b square plus 3 a square b is d cube a plus b whole cube d cube plus 9 d square plus 27 d plus b cube is a 27 3 cube is a 27 now y p is equal to only this part is a division method applying once again Applying once again is a particular integral is a division method e raised to 3t into this part is over okay t upon we arrange in numerator is descending order and this one is denominator ascending order t is t only right in ascending order is 27 plus 27 d and 9 d square plus d cube okay this is a ascending order now using division method is 27 plus 27 d plus 9 d square plus d cube using division method into t okay now cancel t so in the quotient required t by 27 27 into t by 27, 20 to 27 cancel, only t is remaining. Okay. Now, 27 into d into t by 20, d stand d by dt. Okay. Now, differentiate with respect to t, this become is 1. 27, 27 cancel, differentiate t, t become 1. Next, 2 times difference is not possible. Now, change the sign. Cancel, minus 1. Minus 1 is remaining. Again minus 1 you cancel means in quotient required 1 upon 27 required and multiply 27 into minus 1 by 27 27 27 you cancel remaining minus 1 then change the sign this is 0 now this whatever in quotient part that part is a particular integral now therefore particular integral is equal to e raised to 3t this one is as it is then using division method whatever uh, remainder should be zero required okay whatever the quotient part is a particular integral is a t minus 1 27 is common t minus 1 divided by 27 this is particular integral now complete solution is equal to now complete solution is equal to yc plus yp now yc complementary function is c1 plus c2 t plus c3 t square plus particular integral is e raised to 3t into t minus sorry sorry t minus 1 divided by 27 now substitute t value y is in terms of x now y is equal to c1 plus c2 log x t means log x plus c3 t means log x means t square is log x square plus e raised to 3t means x cube this is x cube into log x minus 1 divided by 27 now this is a required solution 